It's often a significant challenge to bring data from one CAD tool into another uh, for various reasons. Uh, first of all, you usually have to translate it and you end up with so-called dumb data. Uh, so it's often, you're often better off recreating it from scratch. The way we work with non-native data today um, is, is, is difficult um, in a sense that it's never, it's never done. Uh, whenever a change is made by a customer or by a design house that we're working with on a program uh, in a non-Pro-E system, that change has to be carried forward. So the work is always being done once, twice, three times um, for every single change. Most every set of CAD data that we receive from the customer needs to have some kind of change made to it. All of our customers provide us CAD data for their engine systems because we need to design our product into their product. So we do need to modify data coming in. Having to work backward um, to make change to the model, bring the changes forward through that process again. Um, every time an iterative change occurs, it's a very painful process, requires several steps of double checking and even triple checking um, the outputs uh, and the inputs to make sure that you've got it right.